All right, so according to this handy dandy little statistic here, apparently 72% of you extremely, extremely attractive viewers are not actually subscribed to the channel, which is like kind of weird, I know, considering, well, all of you should be subscribed, and I'm not really sure exactly why you're not, so why don't you go ahead and do that? Otherwise, I might just pay you a special visit tonight. Hey guys, it's Phantom here, and welcome back to a brand new video, everybody, where in today's video, I am going to be talking about my trials and tribulations that I have had in the past pertaining to fishing. In other words, I am going to be going over just how sucky I was at this side activity. And yes, I know what you're thinking. Phantom, how could you be bad at fishing? No, seriously, how? I, all you do, all you literally do, is just wait for the lure to sink, and then press the spacebar once, and then you're literally done. Like, like, boom, you got, you got a catch, and, and that's all there is to it. And, you know, you'd be right about that. You would be completely right. However, there's one thing that a lot of you might not have accounted for, which, in all honesty, is pretty disappointing, to say the least, because of the amount of videos I've posted recently on the topic, and that is the fact that Child Phantom was a complete and utter dumbass. So let me just set the stage for you here. Fishing had just come into the game, right? And of course, with a lot of new features and things to do within the game, there was a lot of hype surrounding it. I mean, back then, you would go into the commons and there would just be people, right, just people on people fishing in the big main pond area. It was actually fucking insane, and I swear there used to be just so much lag, and I mean even more lag, right, even more lag than there is nowadays in the commons because just of all of those people, right, and there were lures that you would see just pop up every five fucking seconds just used to absolutely kill my PC. So it was a bit frustrating to say the least, but it pales in comparison to the main struggle that I had faced pertaining to fishing. And that was the simple fact that I was extremely bad at it. You see, for the longest time, I just simply didn't know how to fish. And that was that. Yep, I, I just didn't know how to do it. But that did not stop me from trying. I mean, you guys have no idea how long I spent just trying to puzzle out how many times I was supposed to hit the space bar and how fast I should hit it too. Because here's the thing, I, I thought those things actually mattered when fishing, and spoiler alert, they really don't. As I said before, all it really takes is you just hitting the space bar once, and as long as you don't like wait too long after the lure sinks, you'll be just fine. Not to mention, I also at first wasn't very aware of the fact that you actually had to wait for the lure to completely submerge before hitting the space bar. And yeah, I'm, I'm pretty ashamed about that one in particular, but it's true. I don't really know why, but for some reason, I thought just casting the lure and having the fish come to it was enough, but oh boy, was I wrong yet again. And, you know, you, you would think that I might have tried looking up a video or two to figure out how to do this shit properly, but no. No, sir. That did not happen until much later. I thought I was capable of just figuring it all out by myself, but, man, that just wasn't going to happen. <laughs> so, of course, a lot of frustration coincided with, you know, my misunderstanding of fishing. And, truth be told, it simply sucked. I think something like 9 times out of 10, the fish would end up getting away, right? And if you've ever fished in Wiz, you'll be aware of the fact that just the very, very minute experience of a fish getting away from you is the most annoying fucking thing in the entire goddamn world. J just the stupid little sound that you hear, as well as the animation of the fish getting away, just really worked to grind my gears, man. And yeah, it happened quite a bit. <laughs> but okay, okay. Obviously, I figured out the proper way to fish eventually, right? 
As some of you who have seen my fishing streams are most likely aware of, you know, the fact that I, I can indeed fish successfully. However, for some reason, it took quite a long time to hone my skills. Even though, you know, not much skill is actually required, right, <laughs> for the activity, as, as, as you all know. But yeah, for some reason, I just absolutely could not nail the timing, right, on hitting the space bar. And it's, it's so, so easy, too. But for some reason, I would just mess it up time and time again. Another thing that happened quite often too, and I think this one actually affects a lot of people who fish in the game, was basically, you know how sometimes the lure ends up bobbing a couple of times before, you know, it actually gets fully submerged? Well, a lot of times when that happened, I would prematurely just hit the space bar thinking it was time for the fish to be caught. But, well, you know, it just, it wasn't time, and the fish would just end up swimming away, and I hated that. <laughs> because, once again, I was greeted with that same stupid sound effect in animation, reminding me that I was a total failure, loser weenie boy, and that I'd die alone. And that was hard to deal with. You know, my self-esteem struggled greatly. Okay, no, but actually, it just made me really fucking mad. <laughs> I'm a lot better now, obviously, with the timing and, you know, my own patience for that matter, but I definitely still do that sometimes. It's just, god, you, you really think the lure is under the water. You really do. And then it just comes back up, and your life is suddenly in shambles. Your parents are putting you up for adoption, everyone's calling you a disappointment, and it's all your fault. And then there's that one motherfucker, Lucky Hookline, with his smug, smug grin of just pure judgment. And you just want to rip that fish right off of his line and smack him across the face with it. And not in some hot, kinky way either. Just let me make that abundantly clear, okay? The man literally reeks of fish. Yeah, no wonder you're condemned to standing there forever alone in the commons, Lucky Hook line. You cold, cold motherfucker. I've got my eye on you. Jesus Christ, what has this video turned into? Going back to those Phantom Rant roots, I guess. But anyways, I suppose that's about all of the time I have for this video. So I sincerely hope you enjoyed. And if you did, you could always leave a like on the video, as that would help me out immensely, and I really would appreciate it. Let's say one like equals one more day that I don't have to gaze upon Lucky Hookline's ugly mug. But yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for this video, everyone. Once again, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, and peace out, guys.